Hi guys, Mr. Off Waffles here. Today I'm here to answer the question, what happens when you prestige in Black Ops Cold War? And specifically, we're going to be looking at the zombie side of things. So as you can see, if we check out my barracks, I'm level 55. I'm really close to completing it. I only need a little bit more XP to get there. And if you try and scroll right after that level 55, there's nothing. It doesn't show you like a prestige thing there or anything. It just stops. So we're going to check out the rest of my barracks and then we're going to prestige and see what it does. This is my combat record. As you can see, I've got about a day playtime, 60 six games played. A lot of those games were me like downing at round one because I was testing things like XP for the videos I've been making. So I've probably played more games than you guys have for the same amount of playtime. Uh, here's my Intel tab. I still need to get quite a lot of Intel actually. And then I think the only other thing that's really relevant here is the medals. Just sort of showing you guys that I've got a whole bunch of medals and we'll be seeing if those go away or not when I do actually get the prestige. So I think the only other last thing to show you guys would be my loadouts tab. Just so you can see that yes, like I've got stuff unlocked for my guns. My guns have weapon levels, all that sort of stuff. And we'll be seeing if that goes away after our prestige or anything like that as well. Right, there is what level one of your new prestige looks like when you get it in the game. Pretty snazzy stuff. And then I'm going to exfil from this game and check out the new menus. So you've got a nice little animation here for when you level up to that new prestige level one. Love that. You're going to get your sticker and emblem that we saw as that rank one in the game, but you're also going to get a prestige key, which we'll be talking about in just a second. The barracks is going to look largely the same. You've got your military ranks here. And if we scroll through these, you'll see that it is the same progression list as it was before. This is not something new. It's basically just a recap so that you guys can basically refer back to it if you need to. Your combat record will all stay there. You won't lose any of that information. This is not like a stats reset or anything like that. Don't worry. Your medals will all be there. You'll still have all of the stuff in your loadout as well. So it's really not resetting you on any front here whatsoever. You keep your attachments, you keep your weapon levels, everything, okay? The key to it all is this prestige key that we got. And I'm going to explain exactly why we got one of them now, how to get more, and what the hell they're for as well. It's a new system this year that's a little bit confusing at first, but I'm pretty sure I can keep it nice and simple for you guys and you'll understand. So I got a prestige key because I hit my first prestige in the pre-season of the game. This is not season one. Season one drops in December. Currently, there are two more prestige keys that I can get. If I get to season level 50, so that's now that I've prestiged, if I push myself up to the new level 50, and then if I keep going and get to season level 100, I can also get another prestige key. This in the pre-season is the max season rank that you can get to. You cannot go past season rank 100 in the pre-season, and so there are only three prestige keys available right now. And when you get your second prestige key at season level 50, so that's 50 levels away from where I am right now, you're going to get yourself the special Hauer 77 shotgun blueprint called Nightfall. The prestige keys currently cannot be spent. They can only be spent when season one begins in the prestige shop. Now the leveling system is similar in season one, but slightly different, okay? You will still get rewards every 50 levels, just like we're getting in this pre-season at season rank 50, season rank 100, we get a new prestige key. But but the limit will no longer be 100 season rank levels. You'll be actually able to go all the way up to 1,000 in every single season, but you'll get Prestige Master at season rank 200. And then you'll be able to go into the item shop or the Prestige shop rather and equip your legacy Prestige icons as well. You won't be earning Prestiges once you get past that Prestige Master season level 200. You'll just be getting your sort of milestone rewards like XP and maybe some blueprints and stuff like that. But you won't be adding to your count of number of prestiges for that season. When a new season begins, your season level will get reset, but your prestige count will not get reset. So let's say you grind to the end of the preseason and you get yourself to level 100. So that's season level 100 and you'll be prestige three at that point. You jump in for season one in December and you'll see that your level is back to one. You are no longer level 100, but you are still prestige three. And so you can grind through all the way to 200 to get prestige master in that season. And then you can keep going and you won't be adding prestiges you'll just be adding XP and other rewards that they might sprinkle along the way up to a thousand, which is the cap for the season. And then the next season, it will do it all again. You'll go back to level one, but you'll keep the prestiges you earn from the previous seasons. And you can just keep on going, earning those prestige keys, spending them in the item shop that's going to be coming in December. And that's basically how the loop works. It's a bit of a confusing system, but I think it's a pretty good one by the sounds of things. Uh, let me know what you guys think of it in the comments down below. But this is what happens in zombies when you prestige and where the hell the prestige system is going to be going in the next couple of months with season one as well. Thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully this has been informative. Drop a like if it has been. I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.